We are going to cook a delicious chicken and veggie meal. You can make it into a family size meal, pop it into the freezer for when you're ready to use it, or you can make it into single serves so that you can pull it out and make a nice easy lunch for yourself during the week. So I'm going to hand it over to Sabrina and she's going to show us what's in this meal. All right. done is we just had four large chicken breasts um, and all I've done is just dice them up into little pieces. Um, Remembering that the smaller you dice them the further that you can serve them around to people as well. Yeah. Okay so next what we do is we just grab a medium to large stock pot and we just add a litre of chicken stock. And then we just add a litre of water to that one. And we're just gonna pop the chicken in and let it simmer and we're gonna prep some veggies. Okay, so we're just gonna use one leek. So all we have to do is just cut the top and bottom off and then we're just gonna cut it into small slices. Next take four carrots, um, we've just peeled them and then we're just going to cut them into little slices like this. So we're just using some leftover beans and snow peas that we have. So all you have to do is just top and tail these so you just take off the little ends. And then we're just going to put them in a hole like this. And these just chop them like this. We're just going to put them in a hole like that. Some people might not have fresh beans or snow peas on hand. So if you don't, you can always get these um, split peas. So basically what they are, they're just dried peas. And all you have to do is just put them in water and simmer them until they're soft. We're just going to cut up two zucchinis then as well. So again, you just take the top and the bottom off. And then we're going to actually cut this in half and then split it into two. And then we're just going to lay them down and just cut those this way. So we just got some Brussels sprouts and all we're going to do with that one is we're just going to cut it into four. We're just going to cut it down the middle and then we're just going to cut it off so we're down the middle. We have one tin of corn, we're going to add in. So we've just got some broccoli, all we're going to do with this one is we're just going to cut it down the centre like this. And then all we're going to do is the little florets that are on it, we're just going to cut them off like this. And then we're just going to cut them down to about that size. So we have some cauliflower and we're just going to cut it the exact same as the broccoli from earlier. Um, the little kids, it's quite cute, call the broccoli florets little trees and then we call cauliflower snow trees. So, That's yeah, sweet. it's a bit cute. <laughs> we're just going to cut that up. So make some snow trees. We have some turnips, so all we gotta do is top and tail them, we're gonna peel them and cut them into chunks to put in. We add some lemons, um, so what we have done in the past is we juice the lemons and then put them in. Um, we've actually found that it actually works a lot nicer for us personally. What we do is we just chop off the ends 
like so. And then we just take all of the rind off. So you're just left with the lemon without any of the skin on it. And then all we're going to do is we're just going to cut that into rounds, like so. And then we just chuck them straight in. So once the chicken has been cooked, we just take it out of the chicken stock and we just put it in a bowl for now, just so we can use the stock and cook all the veggies and then we'll re-add the chicken a bit later on. So all we're going to do is just add our hard vegetables like our carrots and our turnips. We're just going to chuck them in the chicken stock that we cooked the chicken in. We're just going to add a little bit of salt and pepper. Um, if you have a preference to seasoning, um, this is when you add it in. We're just going to add in our beans. And then at this stage, we're just going to add in our lemon just to soak some of that flavour into the veggies. Next, we just add in our chopped up leek. And then we'll just add in some of our snow peas and our zucchini. So these are some of our softer ingredients, which is why we add them a bit later on. And then we'll mix that one in. So if you get to this stage of adding your ingredients and you find that your liquid um, is a little bit low, we can just add a bit more chicken stock um, just so everything cooks really nicely. And then our final ingredients, which are our pretty soft ingredients, uh, we have all our broccoli and we just return the cooked chicken to the pot again. And then finally, we'll just add in our corn and we'll give that one a mix and let it simmer. Mm -hmm. If you could smell our kitchen now, pretty good. Mm, it's good. <laughs> that meal smells so good. So we are just going to pop it into some containers because we're going to make ours into single serves and get that. Uh, we just let it cool a little bit first, then we'll get it into the freezer. Yeah. And yeah. Thanks for watching. <laughs> God bless. <laughs>